If you could evaluate your security technology using a single number, what would you use? The number of threats identified? The false positive rate? For Cisco StealthWatch Cloud, we have a single metric that drives the development and maintenance of our solution, the helpfulness rating. It works like this. Every time a customer closes an alert, we ask them a simple question. Was this alert helpful? This answer allows us to determine if we are providing something useful and valuable to our customers, or if we are just wasting their time. Over the past year and a half, our average helpfulness rating is 96%. That means 96% of the alerts triggered in StealthWatch Cloud have been helpful to our customers. So how do we achieve this level of helpfulness? With a technology called Dynamic Entity Modeling. At Cisco, we understand network entity behavior and the impact adversaries can have on your network. With StealthWatch Cloud's entity modeling technology, we continuously observe the behavior of all your network entities, alerting you to behaviors that could be indicators of compromise. Our free virtual appliance passively collects real-time flow-level metadata from the on-premises network, and we can deploy without sensors or appliances in many public cloud infrastructures. This data continuously feeds our cloud platform where behavior models for all network entities are automatically created, maintained, and continuously analyzed, no matter their function. With dynamic behavioral analysis along five critical security dimensions, observed behaviors are compared to our robust catalog of device profiles, roles, and learned entity behaviors, continuously validating the normal while rapidly and confidently uncovering the abnormal. In the actual product, this technology provides a number of functionalities. One useful feature is the automatic classification of host roles. Over time, as an entity is active on the network, StealthWatch Cloud models their behavior to determine what kind of device or network resource the entity is. For example, StealthWatch Cloud can identify all of the mobile devices, network printers, cloud resources, and much more. This provides you with an automatic overview of what devices are on your network giving you valuable security insight. Another feature provided by StealthWatch Cloud's dynamic entity modeling is our high fidelity alerts. In this case, we're looking at a geographically unusual AWS API usage. What this means is the AWS API has been accessed from a remote host in a country that doesn't normally access the API. For example, creating an IAM role from an unusual foreign IP would trigger this alert. In this case, if you scroll down, you can see three supporting observations for this alert. What we see is successful logins to the AWS root account from three unusual locations, including Spain, England, and the Netherlands. Now this is concerning because this particular AWS instance is based out of the US and all of the employees who work on it live in the United States. So we shouldn't be seeing a lot of traffic from countries in Europe. So this could be an indicator of compromise. So now the security team knows the time, date, and external IP of each of these incidents, which gives them a good starting place to go in and see if anything else was done and determine if there was an actual security risk. If you would like to try Cisco Stealth Watch Cloud's entity modeling technology for yourself, please sign up for a free 60-day trial at cisco.com slash go slash stealthwatch dash cloud.